So I want Faith to talk about um, the audition you had in the 80s for a little off off, off Broadway musical. I got sent this wonderful script and it was a brand new musical which as you know doesn't happen very often and I read it and I went oh my god this is it this is my role this is my role well it turns out Howard Ashman Alan Minken thought wow. so too and so I was so excited and I got the part the only problem was I had already a job an industrial so I went into the head of the entertainment division and got on my hands and knees and begged him and I said I'm cast in this amazing thing I said it's about a man-eating plant who sings feed me <laughs> and of course he looked at me like I had you know three eyes and just said absolutely not it's your contract this is what you have to do so later that year Ellen Green got the the drama desk and a beautiful it's okay no she has an amazing attitude about you know, it I really I really did and uh, it's funny because I was working up at good speed when all this happened and her Hirschfeld was in the yeah good her speed. Hirschfeld was in the news yeah, well, New you York were doing Times. yeah and everybody was like whispering in the other room don't tell faith don't tell faith and I walked down and I said please I said this is her time I said someday it'll be my time and probably if I'd gotten Audrey in little shop of horrors I probably wouldn't have been Adelaide do you know what I'm saying? So why? that's why the, I say, yeah, because the roles... they're similar. Do you know what I mean? It, it would just have been too sort of on the nose. But, so. but is, that, is that you looking back 20 years later going, I realize now it worked out, or were you really thinking that in the 80s, like, it's, it's all good? Well, my name is Faith. <laughs> <laughs> that's, that's so great. I love no, that. That's true. I mean, I have to have that in my sort of... There were a lot of people that played the part. Were you, at least, you were you replaced though at some point, right? Off Broadway? I, I went in right behind Ellen for both the New York and LA companies. Oh, so you did get to play the yeah, part anyway. absolutely. Okay, so we were talking at rehearsal. I thought it's so cool because she didn't get to do any original cast album. I thought we'd haul out a song from the show um, for y'all. Okay, so just imagine me as a kind of a, a Jewish nerd. <laughs> imagine that. Let's see if I can remember this. Lift up your head. Wipe off that mascara. Here, take my Kleenex. Wipe that lipstick away. Show me your face as clean as the morning. I know things were bad, but now they're okay. Cause suddenly Seymour is standing beside you you don't need no makeup don't have to pretend suddenly Seymour is here to provide you with sweet understanding Seymour's your friend nobody ever treated me Daddy left early, and Mama was poor. I'd meet a man, and I'd follow him blindly. He'd snap his fingers at me. I'd say, sure. Suddenly, Seymour is standing beside me. Wait. 